everyone what's up welcome back to my channel my name is kennedy and this is going to be a day in my life vlog so i actually have the day off today i live in austin texas and i am going to be doing some fun things in austin so i'm pretty new to living here so i'm just trying to like try out some new things so right now i'm about to head to the 360 bridge i think is what it's called like overlooks lake austin so we'll see what that's like i know it's usually pretty crowded compared to like or based on what i read online is what i meant to say but it is like a tuesday afternoon so i'm assuming it probably wouldn't be that crowded versus like um at like 7 p.m or on a weekend so we'll kind of see i'm also like not sure on the parking situation because i've like heard people say that like you park on the side and it says no parking but people just kind of park there anyways or there's like a different place you can park so i hate complicated parking situations like that's honestly the worst so i don't really know um how that's gonna go but we'll see hopefully it's not too bad and we'll just kind of figure it out when we get there but yeah i'm gonna do you can see all my soup <laughs> um but yeah i think today is gonna be a fun day so let's go to the bridge okay so i just found it and there's other cars parked there the first when i just typed in like 360 bridge overlook on google maps it didn't take me there but then when i looked on some website it had like the coordinates and then now it's actually accurate and i saw online that there was like signs that say no parking but they're like everyone just like parks there anyway like is there a chance you might get a ticket yes but like it's like not even really a hike it's kind of just like a short like walk to like the thing so i'll probably won't even be there that long and there's like 10 other cars parked there so i'll probably just park there um but yeah hold on i brought my um little iphone tripod thing because i want to try to take a photo and it looks like there's gonna be quite a few people there so i might just ask one of them to take a picture of me but the thing is strangers aren't very good at taking photos of you it is much easier to get a good photo if you use the iphone tripod which i pretty much have like developed no shame over it and i will just use the tripod and if people want to stare at me then that's their problem it's not mine but it takes like a while and you have to like set it up and stuff so if there are other people then it's like i might be like in the way so we'll, we'll feel it out but yeah let's go because probably shouldn't dilly dally since we're parked illegally <laughs> like straight up like it's like super short you just like go up some rocks there actually wasn't that many people up there i didn't take any talking clips but like i filmed and one part i tried to like zoom in on like downtown in the distance i'm gonna double check now look on my phone make sure i got like a photo that i like uh before i leave because it's like hard to look when you're like in the sun i just like to do the photos and i got one just like of me like sitting like looking away it's nothing groundbreaking but it's a cool view and um especially when people that follow me aren't from austin so they've never seen that view versus if you live i'm literally look, i'm like looking for my camera and i'm filming on it what am i doing the photo i got was cute i think it's cool okay i think i'm gonna stop by my house i want to go to this coffee shop but i have to drive by my house to get there so i'm just gonna go home i think i'm gonna change out of these leggings i'm like super hot i'm pretty hungry right now so i think i'm gonna have one of these okay i'm obsessed with these i've never had them before but i got them at target they're little breakfast burritos it's like egg sausage cheese and potatoes i think i'm gonna make one of these and change and then the coffee shop's called revival it's really cute it's like all pink and stuff and it'd be really cute for photos so i might try to i want to go but we'll see it's like easier to like 
pull out like a iPhone tripod if you're like hiking or doing something outdoors or like at the beach or something I don't really care but like outside of a coffee shop it might not be the vibe either way I want to go because it's cool but like McCall Mitchell I don't know if you know who she is but I follow her she lives in Georgia but she recently came to Austin and she posted really cute photos there and I was like oh my god I need to check that out so we'll see if I get any cute photos I'm definitely gonna go and get a coffee and like sit because it's all cute and stuff but hopefully get a photo maybe not we'll see I think I'm gonna put on a cute outfit though after I eat I'm so hungry Okay, so I got changed. I'm wearing, there's always stuff all over this table. This apartment's pretty small, so I don't have a lot of places to put things. So this table's kind of always a mess. But I put on this dress from American Eagle, and then just these brown sandals. I wanted to wear, let me show you. I got these shoes at Target, and they're pretty comfortable, and I think they're so cute, and my legs looked really good in like a little wedge with this dress. But those are black and this dress I would think I would need to wear brown um like shoes because the black I tried them on it's just like very like intense with like this you know thing but yeah so I'm just wearing the brown sandals but it makes me want to go to Target maybe get a brown pair of wedges so I don't know I guess we'll see yeah, I'm gonna go to the coffee shop I might get matcha which I've never had so I might not even like it but We'll see, I'm excited. Okay, I just went and I got my, I got a matcha and I didn't film anything there. I didn't even take a picture, the vibes were off. The vibes were not there. But I definitely need to film something so now I have to walk back. <laughs> okay, that wasn't a very good clip. <laughs> and then when I showed my matcha, there was like the dumpster in the background. But I did take a cute picture of like just like holding my coffee of the inside of the place. But the vibes were the vibes were not very good, I'll be honest. I'll put the photo that I took on the inside, but I didn't want to walk back in there and film more, honestly. My hair's my hair's kind of crazy. I just like forgot to film in there. Like I was like taking a photo of my drink and then I was like, oh, I'll go like outside. Cause there was like kind of a lot of people inside. Not a lot, but like there wasn't any areas where there like wasn't people. And then I went outside and there was kind of a lot of people too. And it was like, that's what I was saying. Like when you're on like a hike and if you pull out like an iPhone tripod, or even when I do it at like the beach or something, like I really don't feel embarrassed. I mean, if people look at me, it really doesn't bother me but that is like different because that's like a business i don't know i don't even know why i'm still filming on my phone since i'm back in my car but i got a matcha which i've never gotten matcha before this was called the fruity pebbles it was like matcha and oat milk and lavender yeah i mean it just tastes like you know matcha -y which I'm not used to, I don't really like that, but I'll drink a little bit of it. Oh my God, it's so hot. Okay, well, maybe I'll go to Ulta because I did want to get a new straightener, so I might go to Ulta and do that now. Okay, I was on my way home and there's this place near my house, it's called cosmic it said cosmic coffee and beer garden and i was like oh maybe i'll like stop by there on my way home and check it out it looks like it's kind of popping it's like all like outdoor it looks like there's a good amount of tables though so we'll see i don't know we're just trying we're just trying all sorts of things today <laughs> i'll show you what i got at ulto when i get home As always, ignore that table. <laughs> I don't know if it'll ever be clean. Okay, so I'm gonna show you what I got from Ulta. So I got a new straightener. This is the Babyliss or Babyliss. I think it's, I feel like the girl said Babyliss. I don't know. Babyliss Pro Nano Titanium One and a Half Plate 
straightener. I have a straightener right now, but I got it in my Fab Fun box. Like, it, I don't think it's like amazing quality. I don't even. I think the brand's Amika. Um, but I wanted to get a nice one. I think this was like hundred fifty dollars. I had a gift card to Ulta, so I got that. And then I got this NARS Afterglow Lip Balm, which I basically, I wanted, like, so I have, like, a couple lipsticks. I don't really wear lipstick that much, but I wanted something that was, like, this packaging also is, like, so cute. It's, like, pink uh shiny but i basically wanted something that was like a lip tint i don't know if you can it's not even focusing oh you can kind of see the color it's like a pretty basic like pink color but i wanted something that was more of like a lip tint or like a tinted lip balm rather than like a lipstick because lots of times I don't want to wear full on lipstick but I want like some kind of color let me put it on and see okay I feel like you won't even be able to tell the difference but it's kind of exactly what I wanted so that's cool and then so yeah I went to that beer garden place that was really cool they had a food truck but it was like Mexican food and I honestly I don't really like Mexican food and if I do eat Mexican food I like really really basic like chips and queso chips and guac like cheese or chicken like plain quesadilla so it's like almost like pointless to like get that so there was this place that i saw the other day that was a different food truck there's so many food trucks in austin but this is called bat batten creole i'm definitely saying it wrong i don't know how i don't know how to pronounce but basically i got poutine so I'm very excited. It was like fries, gravy, cheese, chicken. And yeah, I just got it to go. It was like outside a bar. Basically like most like bars or beer gardens and stuff here, they have like food trucks, which is really cool. I honestly might end the vlog here. It's like 6.45. So I'm basically just gonna chill, probably watch some Love Island and eat this. And then I'm gonna FaceTime my friend Sarah later because I haven't talked to her um, in a little bit. So we're gonna FaceTime and then probably just chill the rest of the night. So that's really it. I had a pretty fun filled day honestly i had a pretty good day so i'm excited about that but yeah thanks so much for watching if you want to see more vlogs in austin then subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye